This is a video guide on both how to install Lab Solution workstation software as well as how to perform a basic or full uninstall of Lab Solution software. The PC requirements to run Lab Solutions are shown here. Although Lab Solutions can be installed in a 32-bit operating system architecture, we recommend a 64-bit architecture. When you first put your Lab Solution CD in your PC, you should see an autoplay pop-up screen prompting you to run the autorun.exe to proceed with the installation as seen here. Click on that icon to proceed. If you do not see this notification, go to My Computer and open up the disk icon. Select the autorun.exe application by right-clicking on it and selecting Run as Administrator. If you have the compressed digital version of the software, first make sure you uncompress the folder. Once uncompressed, open up the folder, select Disk 1, then select autorun.exe and right-click to Run as Administrator. Select Yes to allow the following program to make changes to this computer. Once the main Lab Solutions install splash screen appears, you will need to click on the Lab Solutions button to initiate the software installation wizard. Once the installation wizard begins, click Next, then input a name and organization as these are both required fields to continue, then click Next. We highly recommend keeping the default installation pathway unless your specific needs dictate otherwise. Click Next, then click Start to begin the installation. Once Lab Solution software is successfully installed, you will need to establish communications between the CBM and the PC. Please refer to our CBM 20A to PC Communications Guide video on our YouTube channel for supplemental information. Once prompted, select Yes to restart your computer now and click Finish. This will finalize your Lab Solutions install and upon restart, you will be ready to begin enjoying Lab Solutions software. Once your computer is restarted, insert your USB license dongle into a USB port. You will then be able to control your HPLC instrument and be able to do your post-run data analysis. The basic uninstall of Lab Solution software will not remove any of your user-generated files. To perform a basic uninstall of Lab Solution software, you must first go to the control panel, then go to Programs and Features, select Sky PDF, then click on the Uninstall button. Click Yes you are sure you would like to remove Sky PDF. Once Sky PDF has been removed, select Lab Solutions, then click on the Uninstall button. The uninstallation wizard will begin. Select Uninstall. Once the uninstallation is complete, select Yes to restart your computer. This will finish the basic uninstallation of the software. The additional steps needed for a full uninstallation of Lab Solutions will remove all of your user-generated files unless you rename the directory folder they are stored to, such as instead of Lab Solutions, rename it Lab Solutions Old. For a full uninstallation of Lab Solutions software, the next step involves using two utility files found in the installation files. Open up disk one, then select Lab Solutions LCGC, then open the Supplement folder. First, select ClearSkyPDF.bat by right-clicking and then selecting Run as Administrator. Click Yes that you want to allow this program to make changes to your computer. Then press any key to continue, and again, once finished, press any key to continue. Repeat the process for ClearLabSolutions.bat file. Right-click on it, select Run as Administrator, and click Yes to allow the program to make changes to the computer. Finally, press any key to continue. Next, open up the Registry Editor program by searching for Reg Edit, then launching the program. Click Yes to allow the program to make changes to the computer. For a 32-bit operating system, open up 
H key, local machine, then open up the software folder, then select the Shimazu folder. Delete this entire Shimazu folder. For a 64-bit operating system, please note the pathway change. You will open up H key, local machine, then the software folder, then WOW 6432 node folder. Then you will find the Shimazu folder. Delete the entire Shimazu folder as the same with 32-bit operating system. Lastly, for a 32-bit operating system, navigate to your C drive on your computer and delete the Lab Solutions folder. Then navigate to the program files within the C drive and delete the Lab Solutions folder in there as well. Please note that in the case of a 64-bit operating system, the pathway is slightly different for the program files. You will need to open the program files parenthesis x86 parenthesis to find and delete the Lab Solutions folder. One final reboot of the computer will finish the uninstallation process. Thank you for watching this guide on installing and uninstalling Lab Solutions workstation software. For additional videos, please visit our YouTube channel. If you have any questions or need additional support, please contact us by calling our customer support phone number. Excellence in science. Shimazu.